the Reinhardt again. And jump out. Oh, you missed you misjudged the timing. Unfortunate. That sucks. Oh, and your and your diva blocked you because she ate the grenades. That's just really unfortunate. That was gonna be such a good personal shield. Hey, you be bubbling her when she goes in. Straightforward, but but good and smart. Reinhardt's no shield, easy target to focus. He's charging away, so turn your attention to the Zarya, right? He is going out of range of you, but the enemy Zarya is right here. Right? She's got no shield, you have yours. This is your your you can you can beat her. Oh no, no no no. That's Zarya's Oh see this is what I'm talking about, about the target selection, right? She was right here. She, she, you could just kind of like ignored her a bit. And again, health bars. You have no idea who of, needs a barrier of these three. So she kind of gets away. Look at her HP, right? You stop shooting at her and she has 50 HP. Right? Target selection, she gets away. Reaper's gonna die. How is the Reaper not dead? Kill the Zarya! Look at her. She's so overextended. She is such an easy target to hit. Like now that Ryan is in front of Zarya, you go for Ryan, but up until that point you should have been hitting the Zarya. He's gonna kill you, oh my god. I need healing, I need healing, I'm at 8 health, I need 8 health. Yep. Yeah, so the target selection, like, I say all the time Zarya is a tank melter. Now, it's tank melter just period. It's not main tank melter or off tank melter. She's just a straight up tank melter. So if, if, there's a, if the off tank is in a better position to shoot than the main tank, go for the off tank. So I think right there, the biggest issue is definitely target selection. Yeah, we just needed. Zarya never died, so I think she has graviton a thousand percent. She did. She did so much damage in that fight and just killed. Basically, killed your whole team. Yeah, we just needed to finish them off. I had so many of them down. I like that you're waiting to personal. Really good uh, discipline there. You're waiting, you're waiting, you're waiting, you're seeing they're not shooting at you, and you wait for them to actually fire. Good job. Oh my god, did your Moira actually just fade into the object into the point? It's How is the red team not punishing that? What is your Lucia doing? I'm drawing them back off the point. I like that you didn't waste ammo there. there like, um, so you switched, Ryan got out, or, or excuse me. So Ryan was out of range. Okay, you, you, you didn't chase him, which is good. You can't chase him because you don't have personal. So I like that you didn't chase him. Moira is the closest enemy to you. She's high priority, so you go on her. Okay, then she gets out of range, and you switch to Zarya. That's good. I'm drawing them back off the point. You're bubbling your ally on the point, fighting. Good. And then right here, I think a lot of Zarya's would, um, you know, keep shooting even though they can't see anyone right here. But I like that, like you shot a little. You shot like you shot seven ammo, and you're like, wait, I can't see anyone, and then you started shooting again. So I like, I like that discipline. Really, really good. Uh, ooh, nice. All right, let's talk about, so right here, you could have definitely weaved in a grenade right here because as, if Moira's fade is like one second away, maybe she's smashing it and she gets away because the ticks from, you know, the laser didn't kill her in that last second. So use grenade to finish off targets with a high escapability. I don't know what her fade was at, honestly. Maybe she just used it and I'm blind. Yeah, she just used it. So let's see, uh, 18. No, she, it, was, it was still four seconds away. So she didn't have fade back, but still just kind of a good habit to get into is you use grenades to finish off those enemies. I, th this Junkrat was, didn't kill you because you had your barrier on, so I like that you just straight finished him off. Really nice. Don't, don't, I, don't, I would not grab this. Don't do it. Oh, punch him, punch him, punch him, punch him, punch him. Okay, I'll, you, don't have to you don't have to grenade him because punch goes through shields. All you have to do is punch him here. Yeah, just punch right there. I think you did more damage to yourself than to him with this grenade.
312. You did like 50 damage to yourself with this grenade, and, but you didn't actually damage him. You got personal though, and your more is healing you, so there's no way you lose this 1v1. Yeah, okay. You got this. Can we have grab bomb for next fight? <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna have coalescence in 18 for- Like the communication, yeah, I have graviton for next fight, kind of letting your team know, hey, this is going to happen. Um, the other thing is you can you call out your diva, say, diva, I want you to combo this grab with me and this graviton. Up right. Yep. If they're up there, Devo, I'm gonna have you do is just bomb right in the middle of them, and then. I'll oh, it's beautiful! It's happening, guys. I'm gonna turn it up so you can hear this beautiful communication from Pascal. If they're up there, Devo, I'm gonna have you do is just bomb right in the middle of them, and then I'll grab right on top of where your bomb is. Beautiful. I like the comms. Keep it up, Pascal. Keep it up. Ooh, you, that one. Wow, I'm actually surprised he went for the shatter. Okay, you're dead. I hope your team doesn't use anything here. I hope your team just says, "Hey, we're down two. They used ults. We've got plenty of time. Don't use anything." No more ults. No more ults. I, you're even calling for we're no more ults. I like it. Oh, your reaper, your reaper didn't get the memo. Your fair has got barrage. If your fair just waits and she holds this, we're down a whole bunch. We can't. We need a whole bunch. We're down a whole bunch. We can't take a point right now. If we need to clean wipe them, don't. Really don't solid comms. I'm impressed. Triple kill. Don't have biome anymore. We do have ult barrage. It's like I'll your diva you did use her uh, self destruct. I'll have bomb when I'm back in mech. Oh no, she didn't. She's just not in mech right now. Okay. Okay. So here's what you do, by the way. You have your Pharaoh wait right here. You come up and you get, you try and get a good grab on here, and your Pharaoh then flies around and then barrages them in the back. And while you're in the doorway, you put a bubble onto her. That was the best drawing. I just want, I just want everyone to know that drawing is for sale for ninety nine ninety nine. Barrage that looks a bit better. All right, they're actually doing it. All right, a good bubble. You're down Reaper though. Just, just leave. Just. Yeah, I just wasted her ult up here. Just get disengage, disengage, disengage. Yep. Disengage, yep. Kill the Zarya though. Ooh, okay, look, so you're, you, this Zarya, she's being too aggressive. She got nano boosted, and so she thinks she's invincible, but she's overextending. So, we, like, you and D.Va can kind of come back here and kill the Zarya, which would be really big. You're considering it too. Oh, the, you see that she's there, you know the Zarya is here. So this grenade plus the follow-up reload is is really bad. You know the Zarya is out of position. Why, you did not need to bubble. She's not even looking at you. Okay, you actually caught, killed her. Okay, you're up too. This is really big. But you, you, you need to make sure your Graviton has follow-up though. Okay, I'll, good bubble. It stopped her from getting- did you guys see that? The bubble here- your Moira, first of all, is getting way too aggressive. But the bubble, right before you go to sleep, saves this Moira's life. She uses Coalescence for when she didn't need to, and the bubble stops the flashbang, right? There's the flashbang right there. So, really clutch bubble on an over-aggressive Moira. Did she seriously bomb you while you were asleep? That's such a feels bad. Please tell me you, you are able to get in here with this. No! Okay, you have no choice. Your barrage is down. Yep, this is... Yep, that's all you can do. Oh! Oh! It's actually huge! You see a sound barrier? Oh, you bubble- you, you can- you never bubble Diva getting into mech because it disappears. That's unfortunate. Man. Oh my god, your D.Va actually combo with you, that was so big. Target selection, McCree is on the point. You and D.Va actually saved this. Use grenades versus tracer, remember, use grenades versus tracer. It, it scares her into using recall a lot sooner. That bomb, I just want to rewind, this like bomb out of absolutely nowhere was just like... It was just like, oh hey, I'm just dropping this off. That's what it left with the bomb. That's like the story of this right here. Just like, 
Boop. <laughs> it's so... It's so funny looking. Alright, sorry. Uh, grenade tracer. Focus the Winston. A huge Winston's on the point. Oh, you tried to bubble the D.Va, I'll give you that, but it got onto someone else, unfortunately. That was a good stick by their tracer. Focus the Winston or the Zarya, okay. You're on the Zarya, I like it, you're on the Zarya. Bubble your Reaper! Okay. Oh, kill the Zarya, kill the Zarya. Diva. I think this is I think this is all she wrote. What? You are literally standing on it. What the heck? I have no idea how that happened, but. So th by the way, that graviton is uh, is one of those grabs where you don't have any choice. You can't wait for a perfect grab because it's overtime. The game's about to end. So even if you grab one versus six and you're the it's that's okay because you didn't have any other choice. So good graviton. Your diva came in with the combo. Um, the bubbles at the end, unfortunate that they got onto the wrong people. I think you were kind of going onto that Anna a little bit too much. Uh, if, like, here's the thing about going onto the Anna, right? Let's see, where was it? Where's the Winston that pops out? Let's see, it was right here. So you want to go for Anna. If you are actually going to go for Anna, you have to, you have to fully go for it, right? You have to turn this corner with grenades, with personal shield, and you kill her. You can't like you can't half butt go for the Anna. You you used a personal shield cooldown going for the Anna, I think. And maybe you just got knocked forward, and I'm reading into it too much. But all right, all right here's the Arissa gameplay. I like the shield placement. Thanks for sticking around till the end of the video. Check out these two other videos on the left hand side and be sure to subscribe by clicking that button on the right. If you like all of this stuff, you can follow me on Twitch, Twitter, Discord, and of course YouTube. All the links will be in the description below. Again, thanks so much for watching guys and have a good one.